Okay, welcome to uh, another playthrough of Clock Tower. This one being Clock Tower 3. Uh, you might be saying, but Pringu, where's Clock Tower 2? Well, Clock Tower 2, I'm, I'm currently playing that too, and it's a pain in the ass. You don't even know. It's so bad. It's, it's, it's so... It's an awful experience. You have to be very specific in that game. I'll tell you guys all about it when I upload that. For now, I wanted to bring you something clockwork, clockwork worthy. It's, even though it's not really a, a, a clock, clock tower type of game. By the way, this game, it took it took me like two days to fix the FMVs because they would they would keep stuttering. It's I think of you painful. Every day. It seems such a long time since you started your life. If I could face Palm in this model, I would. It was after your beloved grandfather went missing while traveling three years ago that I sent you away to boarding school and told you not to come back for at least six years without giving you any explanation. It must have been very painful for you, and I'm sorry, but it was for your own protection. Now, your 15th birthday is approaching, and I fear your life may be in danger more than ever before. Please, go into hiding until your 15th birthday has passed. I know that what I am saying will make no sense to you, but please, do as I tell you and hide as quickly as you can. Your loving mother, Nancy. Mum. Alyssa, you're wanted on the telephone. It's your mother. Hello? Mum? Hello? Are you there? What's wrong? Answer me. Hello? Hello? Mum? Hello? Mum? Mum? Answer me. <laughs> I'm trying not to say anything in this cutscene, but I'm still here. I've seen this cutscene like 30 million times trying to fix this, by the way. Mom, I'm back. Mom. Mom. <laughs> the first time that played, I literally had a heart attack because it was so loud. But now it's predictable. And now I fear nothing. Um, excuse me. Are you one of the lodgers? Yes, I am. Oh. I'm Alyssa, Nancy's daughter. Um, do you know where my mother is? Your mother has gone out. That was early yesterday morning. Huh? She mentioned that she would not be coming back for some time. What? She was wrong. She won't be coming back. At all. So it's just you. You are all alone in this world now, Creepy little bald man girl. Again. I, I... See this guy so many times. I hate this guy. My sweet Alyssa. He's a little creepy too. I've just, been waiting so <laughs> just long telling you. for this moment. Get away from me! <laughs> What's so funny? So this is also the HD texture pack, by the way. So it should look, I'd say, okay. Spoiler alert! I already know where to go. I, I played about 15 minutes of this game before saying I have to fix those FMVs because they were so bad. I, I'm pretty sure they would cause epilepsy because it was so bad the stuttering. Really bad stuttering and rendering. We just grabbed that. Lightning happens. Okay, a little trivia about this game. Uh, this was not made by the same people who made the other Clock Tower games. The second one was their last one on their way out. Oh, yeah, it's just expending like a, pa a panic meter. So, excuse me. Oh, God. Ugh. Okay, a panic meter where, you know, if it gets filled up, she'll she'll be like, ah, and then run away. You know what I mean? I should stop saying that, too. I'm trying to re improve my vocabulary to be more uh, sophisticated, you know what I mean? Also, this game was also made, well, I guess it was made by Capcom, huh? So it was made during around the time where Resident Evil 4 was out, so... Well, I probably have that same 
visual effect. I don't really know how to describe it, but Capcom owns this, owned this at this time, and that's why this game was so different. And it falls off by itself. So there is no Scissor Man. Instead of Scissor Mans, we get a lot of different types of uh, enemies. You'll see as we go on. And ghosts for some reason. This is Nancy's letter. She says this holy water. Holy water protects you from anything. This is your main weapon, holy water. It could stun the enemy and ghosts. And you only have a limited about limited amount of three of them. And it'll improve as the game goes on. And you can refill them at uh, mountain oh, wait, ugh, lion fountains. You'll see. Oh god, the trolls are still kind of finicky. But yeah, human entertainment. I think it was the people who owned it. Okay, let's get out. Of, let's get up, Alyssa, please. Come on. The one, the people who owned this, uh, they went out of business. They went out of business while doing Clock Tower Two. And. They were just kind of rush. They wanted to rush Clock Tower 2 out the door so they could just, you know, get some money before they go out of business, like, completely. And, uh, it shows. Oh, it shows. Okay, so... We just grab this, and we're gonna get teleported to a different world. It's also might, might get a little loud, just telling you this right now. But if I, di if I didn't fix these FMBs, like, right here, if I didn't fix them, this would look like garbage. It'd be black lines and stuttering everywhere. Your eyes would be literally getting burned. Awful, awful, Mom, awful. I came back home. I know you told me not to, but I couldn't help it. I'm so worried about you. Where are you, Mum? Huh. never trust bald people huh all right so we're getting to the part where I was at before before I stopped playing because the game I didn't want to I didn't want to hurt you guys you know what I mean I just didn't want to with all the stuttering and uh, really thick graphical errors we got it working it only took a, a day or two to find the answer all right, so we, that's that door is locked. So I think that's the way back. go through. I'll show you guys what I've learned, alright? Pretty simple stuff. Now, there's a ghost in there. It's gonna come out.
They're pretty terrifying, isn't it? The ghost will attack you unless you go near him. Now, the ring, he needs a ring, because the ghosts, they they need their uh, sentimental items. So you gotta, yeah, spiritual healing. This pretty much explains you have to, like, find the ghost's item that they're, like, tied to, and, like, it's like solving a tiny puzzle. You solve the tiny puzzle, the ghost goes away, and they give you items. So we go right here. I wasted water. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. And then we just use item. Oh. You see? The ghost passes on. We get an item. Last time we dropped some crystal. Yeah, sigil stone. Go over here. Oh god, there's some screen tearing. I might have to turn on the sync. Alright, so this is your save point, and you get to refill your bottled water. Or your holy water. We'll save right now, because this is where I stopped playing, because I really wanted to fix those issues. Okay, now we get to continue going. Also, those, those cans are going to alert any... Like, anything that'll chase you. Anything that's lurking around, it'll chase you. Now, if I remember correctly from playing this game years ago, the main enemy for this game is some monster with a hammer. Like a big, gigantic one. We do this. Oh, so how are you guys doing today, huh? I should be uploading this on Friday. Oh, excuse me. Oh, sorry. I did not get much sleep last night. It's just... I don't know. I, get, I have insomnia, so... It's no big deal. Alright, so we're... Uh, we got the water. The holy water. And I think we're going to have a confrontation soon. I know there's another ghost around here somewhere. It's been a while since I played this. I know the ghost might be down here, but there's an item down here too. But yeah, there's the ghost. Golden fountain pen. Now we need to find the ghost's body and give him give him the give him his little gift. For ghost, please. Okay. I didn't... Well, take that, ghost. Okay, so this is pretty much his... His diary, or something here that he got killed with. I keep thinking it's like, like the triangle button to open your inventory, but it's actually something else. Another stone. Invisibility band, okay. So... I think this is limited, right? Temporary invisibility. So, yeah, like items. Okay, I almost use it. Let's not use it. So, yeah, they're pretty much there. Just You can honestly just run away from them. I don't think you really need their items unless you're, like, really want or really bad at stealth. Okay, just go under here to grab this. Okay, can you, Alyssa, can you get up? Get up! Okay. She did not want to get up! Lavender water? I think this is another item. Let's see. I, that's the wrong- my- my holy water, man! Beautiful Olivia span. Okay, so this is just- I guess it's health? Your health is just really the panic meter. I almost pressed triangle again. Now we have one holy water. Alright, we get this. We can't go across the bridge yet, because I think the gate is locked. Okay. This is where we begin our first ghost spot. Our first, uh, encounter with the- oh. More lavender water. You can see why, because there's actually glass right here that'll make noise. So anything that's like on the floor, they can make noise. And this is Dad's letter. Dear May, how are you? I'm in France, in the region known as 
Champagne? Is that is Champagne? <laughs> it's a beautiful place with vineyards as far as I can see you. When the war is over, we must come here together for a holiday. I hear that it's they are organized for blackouts in London now. I'm sure it's <laughs> Love Dad. That's nice, dear. Yeah, this is locked from the other side. We have to uh, this is, this is, I remember correctly, this is one big, like, chase that happens here. See the glass making noise? I don't remember what chase is this here, though. I'm, I'm thinking it's the uh, Hammer Man. Because I remember, I think the Hammer Guy killed someone in here. And this is, I think, his origin. Christmas tragedy, young, brutal murder. A piano. A piano. I was a piano person. May. Well, here's May. Age 12. Found murdered in Norton's the Taylor. In Norton's the Taylor. She was discovered by Norton. Norton's family nanny, Jane Stride, who returned home to find the victim unconscious, bleeding from the head. Autopsy revealed that it was instant. It was an instantaneous death caused by a blow to the skull with a heavy blunt object. No sp suspects have been named. The victim has been taking part of the 15th annual piano concours, the Victorian Hall in in King, Kingston. The previous day, next to piano is Miss Norton was widely tipped for the first prize. And may have been living with her father since William Norton serving. Okay, young girl who's a piano. Per, uh, I was a piano person. A, pia a pianist. Brutally murdered. This is where the monster man comes. <laughs> And it's recreating the murder. <laughs> okay, so not as scary as Scissor Man, in my opinion. Right. You have to uh, hide from him. Here it is. It also is goofy music. I I remember now. She's fleeing an enemy. Evade, evade points and hide points. First thing you have to search button to make is to take evasive and color attack. You note that most evade can only be used once. Rushes there, camera will switch to first person view while hiding. Hide points can be repeated. Which is maximum. Uh, okay. It's pretty shitty system. If she, even if you're hiding, if your panic meter rises up, you can still, uh. You can still be, uh, what's the word? Oh shit. Well, I got cornered already. Oh, never mind, he sucks. This leads to the front door again, so. Well, good thing he didn't see us there. Okay, as soon as, uh, there you go, he disappears. All right, so at this point on, we cannot make any noise. If we make any noise, he will show up. So we can't step on like glass and, or anything like that. See that's like, I don't think this is the glass, right? No. Sometimes he'll show up randomly. It's, it's really weird how they made this game. Okay, I think we need to go upstairs into that girl's room. Cause I think she might have something. He gets, oh, you'll, you'll see what I mean as, as further we get when we defeat these bosses. Because for some reason, this game has boss battles. Yeah, this is a... I don't know what Capcom really did to the... I don't know why Capcom did this to this series. In my honest opinion, this should not have been a Clock Tower game. It should have been something completely different. Okay, we don't have any tools. I think we just needed to see that cutscene. We'll come back to this place again. 
I don't remember if they spawn outside. I think they do spawn outside now that I think about it. Okay, so we're gonna try to enter here. Oh, here's a refill station. I need a refill, please. So there, now we could. We can't really fight him off, but. See what I mean? He, he spawned. Well, I don't know if he'll despawn if I'm saving it, will he? We're about to find out. Nope, he didn't. Which direction is he coming from? I'm gonna guess he's from behind me. I can't remember where they despawn. Oh, never mind, those are just bottles. I hear his footsteps behind me. I think this is locked. If I remember correctly, it's locked. Yeah, we need an invitation. So we get the invitation from the other house. This guy's pretty easy to avoid. I can, like, 360 and throw holy water in, but I don't think it... Stumps them momentarily, but I think they give up the chase after a while. We're gonna go back to the Norn's house. Like, see, I already outran him. Like, he's already... I already lost the panic meter. I forget if they follow you in here. No, they don't. Okay, well... Oh, I stepped on glass. I guess it's just... Oh. Well, now we gotta circle around. Ew. This is another big, it's just a big, okay, we need to go through that door, I believe. Okay, I don't think this will work. Yeah, I didn't think so. I'm already gonna run out of health, and then if you run out of health while while like this, you it's pretty much you die. It's a one shot kill if he if he hits you when you're like this. Alicia, where are you? We're gonna go in here, and hopefully he's not in here. Yeah, okay, he's coming. God damn it. Please. Let me hide. Is there anything in here I can... Well, that didn't work. Okay, we got a poker. Now, I don't know if that makes them disappear or just stuns them. Okay, that... That really didn't do anything. Alright, so I'm just gonna grab... I am actually gonna leave the room. Cause I'm scared he's gonna get up and it's gonna go that stupid music again. Let's see if it starts back up. If it starts back up, at least I'll be way ahead of him. Okay. I'm gonna... I don't hear the music playing again. I'm gonna assume he disappeared. You better have disappeared. If you're still there, I'm, I'm literally gonna scream. Okay, he's not here no more. We can't use the poker anymore, so let's just grab the key. That's the dad of the daughter. And I believe this is the key to her room, right? Red drawer. Okay, just kidding. This is just the key to downstairs. Now, another thing I don't like about... they, they I remember doing this. I remember playing this. And they spawn... Uh, sometimes they spawn, like, really frequently. In a span of, like, five minutes. Other times, it'll take them a while. I think it's just random intervals, or the further you progress. Either way, it's really annoying. But I think if you step on glass or anything, it might increase the odds of them, him showing up. So I'm just not gonna... I'm gonna try to... I stepped in glass anyway. God. I say that as I step in glass. 
Okay, we go here and we open this with the red drawer key. Uh, not, not options. No! Key items and red drawer key. Just kidding. I think you have to open it just by interacting with it, but sometimes, okay, it's just, I'm not even gonna say anything. Okay, there we go. May room, okay, so it's a key to get another key. I remember when I first played this, I just spammed the holy water on them. To see if that would work. Okay, here's our diary. Oh god, the music. Today, I darned daddy's socks and sewed the button. Darned. Call himself a tailor, but he isn't even his own clothes. I'm not your- what the? Only a few more days until... The conquerors, I still can't play this perfectly. What am I going to do? I know Daddy's wishing me well from far away. I must try my best for Daddy. Don't worry, Daddy. I'll make you proud. Now, that's just sad. Alright, so we just need to find the invitation to get into the main hall. There's the invitation. So now we can get... Now we can get into that main hall. Oh, that's nice. He's outside the door. Alisa. Please don't call my name like that. Escape truck, what would I do? So let's grab this. Alisa. Well, that didn't work. Oh, well, that somehow did work. Just rushing him. Alright, now we need to move because he's going to get right back up soon. When I... Now they have the invitation. We can leave this area. Don't ask how a big man like that got defeated by this little girl. But, um, you know, Clock Tower. I still don't consider this a Clock Tower game. Oh, there he is. So, cue the music. <laughs> that, I hate that music so much. I hate this music. I love this Clock, I love Clock Tower. I love Clock Tower so much. But, not, not this one. Okay, we got the... Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm busy with the fountain. Let me just save real quick. Okay. What do you want, old man? I think he'll stop following us once you... Okay, well, I don't know why he went that way. Oh, he disappeared. He disappeared or he teleported? No, he disappeared. That's weird. There's a moth. Wow. And we're locked in here now. Another save area. I guess there's a save again. Just why not, right? I like how the music just disappears. Okay. Don't worry. Everything's gonna go great. Here to fix the past. <laughs> Nothing to be scared of, it's just a piano. With a a used piano. Fix spirits, right? We gotta gotta give them something to remember them. 
like something to help him pass on. You know what I mean? For her, she keeps messing up. Okay, we need to get her spirit and get her back to the piano, if I remember correctly. First, we gotta deal with this ugly thing. He's so ugly, man. I, why did they make him like that? Well, even a hit counts as a, as a like, you know what I mean, a non-hit. Don't ask me what that did. I honestly forgot what that did. Oh. Normally that would freak me out, but like, they don't... They, they... There's not really much danger if you really think about it. Safe competition. Bad. 10-3. 10-03. Or 103. We need to go out and find the safe. <laughs> I gotta get past uh, the hunchback of Notre Dame over there. Excuse me, sir. Now, I just need to remember where the safe is. Oh, I need a special key for that. Hold on there, governor. There. <laughs> it's so. F this first guy, I don't remember the others very much, but I do remember this first guy. Well, oh, that's just a bottle. Hold on there, general. that to get the key from him, I think, and then we scoot this back up, we gotta go back up there. Keep stage advice raised at all times with management. Don't know why he can't come back here. I wonder if I stay back here, he'll disappear. Okay, that's not... Yeah, he's gone. Okay, so now we know that he can't, uh, he can't come back here for some reason. So the safe combination was 103. And, uh, let's go see if we can try to look for it, because, damn. Let's see, was it in the main room? It's kind of distracted. But yeah, that, uh, that big guy's no issue at all. He's... This first guy is a real push. Okay, this is back to the entrance. The first guy is just a real pushover. Now, I believe some of them later. I think the scariest one for me. Oh, what's this? I guess we'll see later, huh? This thing is just health. Is there a safe back here? You got a safe? Oh, yeah, 103. Okay, dial number. One. Zero. Three. And I think this is the special key. Yeah, the master key. Let me just save real quick, because, you know, saving is cool. Also, this game is not very long at all. I think if you played it before, you could probably finish this in, like, under five hours. Like, four hours and 30 minutes. And it just, uh... It's not as bad... That's the second one. I can tell you that. The second one is just pure pain. The second one you have to do very specific things or else you you just fail. Like you don't get like the true ending. And I think this game has one ending. Oh, I don't remember. Okay, I think that's back to the entrance. Lead us, this will lead us to the catwalk and we just walk across and I think there's something there's something specific we need because we need we need to help that girl like you'll see when we get there okay it's kind of hard to explain even more health god just all the health
But yeah, I don't know why they named this a Clock Tower game. It doesn't really feel like a Clock Tower game. I don't know. Is it really a Clock Tower game without Scissor Man? I forgot if you can take that lantern or not. For me, Clock Tower game was like the first PS1. Oh, he's behind me. You're mine now. The lantern is not lit. I'll have to light it. I'll have to light it because we need to go across. Okay. I actually forgot where it was. Well, that's weird. He's going to stay up there. He's not going to follow us down here. Strange. Strange. Okay, I'm going to go back up there then. I'm going to double check. If not, if I can't find anything up there, I'm just going to go back over there. If he's going to come back, then he must be needed here for something. You're mine now. I guess he's just here to push us along the wall, because there's really nothing here. It's too dark. Too slow, too. Okay, so we need something to get to the lantern. Let me go through the other door that was on the other way, that double, that double door. He's not going to follow us down here, because I don't know why. So if we go up there, he's just going to continuously just keep spawning over there. So I think this must be a safe area, I guess. This right here. It's a place where he can't come in. Let's go through those double doors and see where that leads me. Oh, God. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, panic mode. Now I'm one hit if I get hit by that. So we we'll just use this. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. I'm going through a door. You can't get me. Wow, he actually hit me that time. Okay, I was trying to open the door. Okay. Now, now we're just getting a little too ridiculous. Also, another thing when you're in panic, you can fall down and you can, you can trip. Damn, you're fast. Okay. The controls are a little wonky. If I ducked down like that and he didn't see me, what? Can I open that door now? The enemy in this game is a camera sometimes. Okay, he's literally gonna keep on chasing me the entire route, is he? Oh, he's not gonna chase me over here. Okay, interesting. So what's behind here? Nothing. So like most of these old games, the main enemy for you can also be the camera. I was spamming the button to open the door and I could not, and I wasted two of my health health items to uh, get through. Now I think we're supposed to be looking for like a lantern or a matches, I can't remember. side. We're out of holy water too. This door is open. Nothing inside. Ah, there it is. Matches. If I remember correctly, he might come in here. I like how that door is just open. Okay, so that was just there for the matches. Now we just go back. We just go all the way back. Oh. Why did that make the meter go all the way up? You're mine now. I hit it with the a box. 
Well. Now we get out of here because our panic meter is going to get all the way up and then we we die. I swear, this, this game can be so janky. You pick up this easy uh, invisibility band? I should probably use those, huh? Do I just disappear out of his sight like just out of nowhere or do I have to get out of his sight and then use it? Now I think he might... No, I don't think so. Okay, so we gotta make ourselves back to the catwalk. Good thing I put... Good thing we put that uh, service thing all the way back up, because if we didn't, we might have to... Uh, go all the way back down. Boy, I wish I had some holy water right now. Okay, that's a little cheap, don't you think? Okay, hold on, I'm actually gonna use this stupid... Okay, why? He, she literally just stood still for no reason. He's right up... Oh. Damn, you got a really good recovery time, I'll tell you that much. Oh, he's not gonna follow us up here? Actually, that just tells me like the, the, the chases are kind of scripted, you know? It's not really like a random, uh, there is a random factor, but I guess some of them are scripted. I don't know, it just doesn't, okay, not gotta be careful here. Come on, don't fall. Oh, 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 just, come on, just walk straight, just walk straight. Pliers, that means we gotta go all the way back outside. We gotta go back outside to the... To the little office, or the little tailor place. To open that door that's all bolted up with wires. Also, yeah, there's a lot of backtracking in this game. But you know what game doesn't have backtracking? Oh, nice moth. Save me. I guess not, Moth. Elisa, where are you? Elisa. Damn, I hate this guy. Elisa, where are you? He, he's already losing us. Okay, store here, and then we open this door. That's what I could I could lose them if I wanted to if I go the other way, but let's just make this exciting, huh? Let's make them chase us all the way over. Master key. And we lost him. Oh, never mind. Just kidding. Alisa. Gonna... You're gonna follow us all the way to the safe point, you guy? He's literally gonna follow us all the way there. Well. Hold on. I gotta save it, then I can get more holy water for you. We fill, and then we uh, save. Not as scary as I remember. Now, I didn't finish this game, but I do remember the first and second level. 
After that, I don't know much. Oh, just, just instant panic. Okay, hold on. I better not stand still if I use this, because I swear! There is no Alyssa. Mothman! Get a moth! Okay, we lost him. Never mind, just kidding. Alyssa! Dog, that- I keep pressing- I keep thinking. It's the- that's the inventory button, but it's not. I'll use this ring to be invisible. until he disappears. Elisa, where are you? I hate this guy so much. He's searching around. I'm not getting out until your music stops playing. Go, he's gone. Now we can go in here and use the pliers. I swear, if I hear Alyssa, where are you? One more time. I think this leads to. I think the dad's room? No, actually, we've already been to the dad's room. Oh, just kidding. Maybe it is a dad's room. Just kidding twice. Get, to get double, just kidding. Repellent arrow. Now that's part of the magic goal Alyssa said. You'll see why. Piano. There's a specific thing we're looking for. Ah, the music box. Here it is. That's what we're looking for. This is the item that the ghost needs to move on. So this will help her. to tell you something important. Daddy's going off to war. War? I hate the thought of leaving you here all alone. I feel dreadful. I'll be all right. But, but what about you? You'll miss me and be sad when you're in war, won't you? Yes, yes I will. You're the most precious thing to me in the whole world. But don't worry. Daddy, don't forget the piano concourse is on Christmas Eve. The winner will have their performance aired on the radio. I'll practice really hard and win the contest so that you can hear me when you're out in the war. That will be wonderful. The competition will be stiff, but if you go to your lessons and practice properly, I'm sure you can do it. I'll practice every day. I've already chosen the piece I'm going to play. Listen. You told me this watch was a present from Mummy before you got married, remember? Play the I'll play this thing. tune on Christmas Eve, so you can think of Mummy and me. Then it'll be like we're all together again. He never made it home. And the daughter was brutally murdered. So, eh, thus, that's the harsh reality of war sometimes. There's more inside. I think this is about the, yeah, the hammer killer. Hanged. 1940, so that was World War One then. Robert Morris, 32, man known as the hammer killer. Kind of original. Has been hanged. Rumor regarding Morris' 
death are widespread. One witness reported he was hanging for a very long time, pulling on the straps, making unearthly noises, and blood was oozing through the black cap. The stench was terrible. Some witnesses fainted were carried out. Morris's first victim was Tony Fanagan, 35, a fellow employee at the Banbury Stone Cutting Factory. On 6 June 1940, Morris suddenly struck Fanagan on the head with a hammer, killing him instantly. Uh, all five workers present were killed in the same manner. Morris disappeared thereafter. A string of similar crimes occurred until the time Morris was arrested on the 6th of March in Arlington, Hampshire. Morris' victims are number 12, and no clear motive has been determined. Such things continue to baffle by the seemingly abrupt changes in his behavior as well as crimes. So he just started killing people with a hammer. Alright, now this is the part where he shows up. And he goes, Alisa, where are you? Alright, now we just gotta get back, right? No problem at all. No, nothing will happen. Certainly nothing. There's a door. There it is. If I remember correctly, last time he showed up on when I was halfway there. And I was outside. And he showed up behind me. Or actually, he might show up in front of me this time. I might have to... Okay, you'll see, you'll see, you'll see what happens. I'm gonna save, just in case. But yeah, we have the item that the ghosts need to move on. I'll just do a quick refill. Well, I guess I'll save first, then. I swear, some of these old PS2 games... Sometimes the PS1 games work better. But it's okay. I'm not here to fault the game. Not completely, anyway. Yeah, here it is. How creepy. You figured me out, little girl. They thought they got rid of me that day in the gallows, but they were wrong. Little May was only the beginning. Why? Why did you kill her? <laughs> You're next. <laughs> Alright, now this... This is where we become Magical Girl, Alyssa. Zero's a duck. And we shoot arrows now. Don't ask why. And we can charge the arrow. And R1 for a special attack. Uh, Mr. Must Transfix. So you have to keep hitting them with arrows, I think. It's to, like, it's to, like, pin them into a certain spot. Then, uh, once it's, the once they're all, like, pinned, you hit them with a the special attack, and they go down. Duck is used to avoid enemies' attacks. Uh, okay, okay, R1 for special arrows, such as repelling arrows, okay, I have one repelling arrow, now special attack was R1, okay. We are now magical girl, Alyssa. Don't ask where this power was this entire time, but it, it's here now. Crazy, isn't it? Clutch hammer. Victims 26. Sentence to 486 years. And that's his health. All right. Pretty simple stuff, he's really slow. I don't even need to aim either.
Okay, that actually hurt me. We're gonna hold him still. Oh god. Pretty simple boss. I don't really know what to say. We just keep shooting him with arrows. And it just gets worse and worse over time. I don't really sure if this is exactly what it's supposed to do, but I guess it's working. Because I, I kind of forgot how to do this. Well, what a riveting boss battle, isn't it? Well, time for the special attack. <laughs> riveting combat, too. Jesus. Do you think that hurts? I think they're fine. So yeah, you shoot them with enough arrows, they can't move, and you spam them, and then they just finish them. And you send them back to oblivion. Clover of Love. Now we have four holy water uses. And now he's not here to chase us anymore. So let's go give this uh, watch to the little girl so their dad, they can be reunited and they can move on together. A shell. Well, do you think that was necessary? I'm so sorry. Please don't cry. I understand how you feel. I never even knew my father. I lost him soon after I was born. But I love my grandfather just the way you love your father. Keep this watch as a memento of your father and continue to practice the piano as hard as you can. You know that would make him happy. There we go. May. May. Daddy! Wow, where were you the entire time? Thank you, May. Your beautiful playing has brought me back to you. At last, we can be together again. Now, where's Mom? Thank you, Alyssa. How do you know my name? Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye, mate. Goodbye, Mr. Norton. Goodbye. <laughs> imagine this is what, imagine you just go home to go see your mom, and this is what ends up happening to you at the end of the day. <laughs> Goodbye. Well. Hey, man. Ghost hunting. Uh. Ghost hunting, defeating a serial killer, sure it's exhausting, you know? And we're back home like nothing ever happened. It was all a dream, see? It was all a big dream. What was that? Have I been dreaming? Yes. Save game. 
I think that is where I'll cut it for today. The first stage is done. And then now we're going to have to get to the second stage. It's going to be great. And I hope to see you there too. No spoilers! No spoilers! No spoilers. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Thank you.